have Samuel, our stunt double. Do you normally shoot at night? It's kind of uh, a mix. You know what? My first big movie, Fast and Furious 3 Tokyo Drift, brings back the memories for a lot of night shoots. It's not my favorite. It's It sucks. Uh, you get tired. It's uh, brutal. In, movie, in the movie world, you're sitting waiting around for hours. Suddenly, they call you up to go and do yep. a chase scene or, or whatsoever. So you got to be on it and ready at 3 a.m. suddenly and you know drive for a couple hours and then go home. But yeah. So it's exhausting. Yeah, it could be. Yeah, a lot of pressure. It's always a pleasure driving these Dodge uh, Hellcats because they have so much torque and power. So it makes it easier for us as stunt drivers to uh -huh. perform drifting and throw 360s and such because they're they're powerhouses and have a really good power line. You know, good differentials in the rear it gives both tires. You know, spinning and right. gets you to do what you want to do. Well, the Hellcat is the kind of juiced up engine. Has okay. a big supercharger. These have 717 horsepower. Okay and tons of torque so it's just tap the throttle and and then the tires will spin so it's a real uh, deal yeah it's a real deal they're fantastic machines these are great cars you know, for this type of car chase scenes we've been doing because uh -huh. you can always pitch it sideways you always have the power it has good steering angle too and the torque just helps you to 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 get the car where you want it right away yeah. for for the, for the directors asking uh -huh. to you know rush the frame and such so well i mean cars like this i mean i, I love